All right, so we are back with another kettlebell basic series, and we are going to start working our way through the kettlebell swing. But first, before doing, being able to do a kettlebell swing, you have to learn how to hinge. So a nice way to start thinking about this is you can use a wall. We have a beam here that Savan is going to use. Just pretend that that's a wall, right? So you can do this at home. And what you do is you get yourself up, heels, butt, head, everything is touching, and then you measure one foot length away from the wall feet about shoulder width apart, or maybe a little bit narrower, and then start sitting the hips back. Reaching back, creating a V with the body. That looks pretty good. You can experiment, maybe walk a little bit forward or back, but everyone's gonna have a different body type. So, as she sits back, that even looks better because she's struggling to get back there. Um, play around with this, try to find your perfect hinge pattern, and remember that it should look like your body is making a V with the upper and lower body. Give that a try and then let us know what you think. 